Hi everyone, this is Anson from AnsonAlex.com and in this video I'm going to show you how you can set up multiple users on your Android phone. Right now I'm on one of my home screens and to enable this feature all I need to do is tap on the settings symbol and it will take me to my system settings. Now, depending on which version of Android you're running and what type of phone you have, this may look a little bit different. I'm using a Pixel 6 right now, but essentially these features should be in the same place. Uh, so just look around a little bit if you can't find it right away. So from within my settings, I'm going to scroll down to the system option. You can see it's almost all the way at the bottom uh, and I'm going to tap on system. And then from system, I'm going to scroll down and I'm going to tap on multiple users. It's almost the very last option on your phone here. You'll notice that right now it says I'm signed in as Anson. And then when I tap on it, I have the option to enable multiple users. So if I tap to enable, you'll notice that right now I'm signed in as the admin. I can add a guest if I'd like, or I can add a user. So a user allows somebody to come back and use that account multiple times. They can customize wallpapers and their settings and the apps that they're using, all of that sort of thing. So this is great for like another family member. And a guest uh, account would just be somebody who's using it uh, for a temporary time. That account will get deleted after the guest is done using it. So there are two kind of options there for you. So if you tap on add user, you'll notice that it says, are you sure you want to add a new user? Uh, they need to set up their space and it is quite a lengthy setup process. So I'm not going to go through all of it, uh, but you can go ahead. You could hit OK and you would customize the phone just as you would if you just gotten the phone and you were setting up the initial user account. So you can do fingerprints, your passcodes, uh, connect your email. If you're using Google, you could connect your Google account, all of that sort of thing. And then the same goes for if you tap on add guest, it's actually a lot quicker. So this is another benefit of using the guest feature. You'll notice that right away it says we can switch to start using the guest account and we could also allow them to do phone calls as well. However, if we do that, they're going to have access to our phone call history and our SMS messages. So that's up to you whether or not you want to grant access. And obviously you can see whenever you're done with the guest account, you can just tap on remove guest and it would remove that account. Uh, so it's as simple as that. That's how you can use multiple users on your Android phone. Uh, I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, I would really appreciate a thumbs up here on YouTube. And if you want to see more technology tips and tutorials, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's all I have for you for today. This is Anson from AnsonAlex.com.